So as I promised you earlier, we have Kwame Eugene on the line. Hello, Kwame. How are you doing? Hello, I'm fine. Yourself? Charlie, I'm blessed, though. Today's a special day for you, right? Yeah, yeah. You're releasing yeah. your new, um, you're, you're releasing a single from your new EP. Yeah. All right, yeah. Kwame. Yesterday, I spoke with Kwame Yogurt, and uh, he was just singing praises about you. The fact that you helped him to, you know, um, put his album together. How was it oh. like you working with him? Um, uh, I, I, okay, I'm just saying, Kwame Yogurt is a brother now. Mm hmm so working with him is not that difficult. Okay. It? Um, and he, and he's kind of a soft person. Oh, okay. Yeah, he understands, and so long as you have been in a game before him, he he likes you to take a lead and and advise him on what to do. I mean, yeah, because I've I've had situations where I've I've been in a studio with artists, and even though I'm writing for them, they make it look like yeah, sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> but come you got is is like. Is that calm guy who is, is very easy to work with? So, all right, shout to Kwame you got to. All right, it's not just me, he did this work, yeah. Okay, and uh, thank you so much for helping a brother out. Anyway, let's not talk you. about your 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 EP Afro High Life. Yeah. Why that title? Afro High Life because I mean, it's just obvious you know what's trending at the moment, everybody's mm -hmm. trying to jump on Afro beat. But then again, I get it because Afrobeat is, is is moving very fast, it's going all over the world now. So, you know, and 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 in order not for me to leave her life behind, because I'm known for her life, and that is one mantle I want to hold on to. Mm. I figured, you know what? Why not fuse my high life into the current Afrobeat that's going on? Yeah. So I want to be known for a different genre, a genre that represents the high life generation, but um, the the very specific one that I find myself in. Okay. So I came with up with a journal that that is going to represent what I do. Mm, so it's mm. a fusion of Afrobeat and high life music. Okay. So now my my new journal is Afro High Life. That is what I do as an artist. How so many songs do we have on this particular EP? EP? Okay. Just five songs. Yeah. Just five songs. Can you um, run me through the titles? Yeah, I have Bunker, which I released today. Mm -hmm. I have Fire. Mm -hmm. I have Tenefie. Mm -hmm. uh, then I have um, Demigod. Yeah. Demigod. Did you work on any of the songs with another artist or is it just no, you? No, no, no. This, this is just all me. Mm. So um, is, is this just going to be an EP or you, you, you're working on a bigger picture, like an album, sort of? No, no, no. A bigger picture. It's... it's no, it's just going to be an EP for now. Mm -hmm. But then again, I want it to reach a lot of people. So they're going worldwide with this. I mean, the promo is going all the way up there with this. Because, you know, there's a big room for Afrobeat and mm -hmm. Halal music now. Mm -hmm. That's how I see it. So uh, I believe I have I have good songs on the EP for it to get to that level. So that's the target. Okay. And did you, did you produce everything yourself? I literally produced everything um Besides one very song, a very authentic high life song that I needed to produce live. So I, I, I called Afro Harmony in to help me do that. So Afro Harmony and Richie Mensah and Jeff for the legendary George Dark who was part of the production. Mm, mm, mm. And uh, are you looking at having um, an international collaboration when it comes to your album? Yeah, I'm I'm working on the EP at the moment, so okay. I'm I'm not thinking of an album okay. for now. In 2021, I'm still working on this EP, All right. and I wanted to get to that level. But you know how things are being done these days. Mm. Uh, there there might be a song on the EP that's already out, but then again, if it 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 arrives a remix with an international act, we are definitely going to do it. We're actually looking forward to that. Yeah. All right. Now let's talk about the bunker. What is it? Oh. What um, is a bunker? You, I mean, you know. And a normal bunker. A bunker is like a military base fortress where, I mean, people go to make plans or people go to a hideout where they feel safe. Mm. You get like, 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 like when there is war, a bunker is a place that you go to hide to feel safe. Or, and, and that's the same place that you make most of your decisions from. Okay. So I, I'm, I was just talking about somewhere that I feel safe. Mm. Yeah. Mm, mm. And where do you feel safe, please? <laughs> in, in in my studio and I mean somewhere else I can't mention. <laughs> oh, really? And who shot the video for the banker? 
Come again? Which other video? Because I know you are releasing it together with um, the video. Yeah. Rex, Rex shot it. Rex shot it. Um, yeah. uh, Okay, okay. So before we play it, I know you were supposed to go for another interview, so I want to make it so quick. Yeah, I'm on my way to... I know, right? All right. I know, I know. Um, so um, a quick uh, introduction of the bunker, and then we will drop it right here in Takradi for you. What's up, it's Rogue Star from the Union. The thing you're about to listen to is Bunker from Kwame Eugene on Wires in Takradi. Keep it locked. Don't go anywhere. African number one. All right. And Kwame, are you thinking of coming to Takradi anytime soon? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm pretty much sure gonna. Uh, I mean, I need to. Okay. Yeah. All right. So 